السلام علیکم آئی ہوپ یو آل آر فائن اینڈ سیف ایٹ یور ہوم ویلکم بیک ٹو مائی چینل ٹوڈے وی ول اسٹڈی بون ہیبر سائیکل ان دا پریویس ویڈیو وی ہیو لرن اباؤٹ دا ہیسس لا وچ از امپورٹنٹ فار شارٹ اینڈ دس بون ہیبر سائیکل فار این ایس سی ایل از امپورٹنٹ فار لانگ سو لیٹ اسٹارٹ اوور ویڈیو If you haven't watched the previous video for the Hess's law, link is in the description. You can watch it from there. Habit cycle is the application of Hess's law. I want to tell you one MCQs. So, this is the application of Hess's law. It helps us to calculate latest energy of binary ionic compound. Means this is the MCQ. They must give you some options. So the correct answer is latest energy. Von Haber cycle is used to determine latest energy of molecular solids. No. Ionic solids, covalent solids, metallic solids. So the correct answer is B. Ionic solids. Yeah, ionic compound. M plus X minus. So this is the MCQ which I have to uh, which I have to discuss. then now moving towards the bond haber cycle so for its the application of application of hess's law first point and second point is it determines the latest energy energies of ionic solids or ionic compounds then we have to write uh, the formation of nacl sodium chloride first step is there are two steps so The first step is Na in the form of solid react with half of chloride which is a gas gives NaCl. This is single step which is in the form of solid. Here enthalpy of formation is included. This is first step. Nacl and chloride reacts and gives in the form of ions sodium and chloride ions these are gas and gas react and give nacl in the form of solid so this is step 1 or step a and this is step 2 or step b del h x is included and here in dolphy chain del h l is included so we have to find this value as well as this value then according to the hess's law in dolphy formation del h f is equal to del h x plus del h l this we can find it easily how we can find it by the step 1 so the value of del h f is minus 411 kilo joule per mole in order to find del h x we have to solve step a In step A, four enthalpies are included: enthalpy of atomization, enthalpy of ionization, enthalpy of atomization of chloride, and uh, enthalpy of electron affinity. So four enthalpies are included. Forces. I am writing in short. Enthalpy of automization 80 represented by 80 and 
enthalpy of ionization i dot e then enthalpy of uh, atomization of chloride and uh, enthalpy of electron affinity so these four enthalpy are included and you have to remember the values by heart in exam it is not given for nacl so first we are solving step a which includes four enthalpy means four step we are solving this this one first step step a first you will discuss sodium sodium in the form of solid converts into sodium in gaseous form and this is enthalpy of atomization which value is plus endothermic 108 kilojoule per mole kilojoule per mole is a unit you have to mention it and this is enthalpy of atomization then this is first step then second sodium in the form of gas converts into gaseous ion by by losing one electron and a plus plus one electron is lost this is gas again and this is enthalpy of ionization which value is plus endothermic 49 6 kilo joule per mole then moving towards the third point which is the of atomization of chloride chloride is in the form of gas to we convert it into the sing single atom in the form of gas here enthalpy of atomization is included which value is plus endothermic 1 to 1 kilo joule per mole then fourth step is to convert this to single gaseous atom plus by gaining one electron it is neg with negative sign here it is gas and here is also gas here is enthalpy of electron affinity included in wall which value is minus 349 kilo joule per mole and we can find the value of del x del hx by del hx is equal to del at by adding this all four enthalpy del h 80 plus del h i ionization plus del h atomization of chloride del h uh, electron affinity so by adding all enthalpy we can get the value of del h and putting in the above equation we are known with the value of this enthalpy of formation which is minus 411 and we can find uh, value of this by putting the all the values and by rearranging the equation we can find the enthalpy of formation for latest energy so we can find the value of del hx by adding all the enthalpy enthalpy of atomization of sodium plus enthalpy of ionization of sodium plus enthalpy of atomization of chloride plus enthalpy of electron affinity so their values are enthalpy of atomization of sodium is plus remember mention the sign otherwise it will be wrong plus 
आइनाइजेशन ऑफ सोडियम इज फोर नाइन सिक्स दैन प्लस इंथॉलफी ऑफ एटमाइजेशन ऑफ क्लोराइड इज प्लस वन टू वन एस इज एक्जोथर्मिक विद नेगेटिव साइन थ्री फोर नाइन now adding them we will get the answer so we get the answer plus 376 376 kilo joule per mole now the equation was del h f is equal to del h x plus del h l now we are having the value of del h as well and del h x as well so we can find the enthalpy of latest energy as well by rearranging this equation so del h l is equal to del h f minus this is plus here and go here become minus del h x now putting the values this is minus 411 minus plus 376 so we get the answer minus 787 minus 787 kilo joule per mole kilo joule per mole so we have find the value of del hx and del x l latest energy and del x l latest energy now moving towards the diagram or energy cycle of nacl 